Welcome back to the Closer Look. Joining me now is John O'Hurley. You might recognize him from Seinfeld, Dancing with the Stars, Family Feud. Got you, you've a been all things. over the place, and now you're here in Midland. Absolutely, and I'm bringing uh, I'm bringing Chicago to Midland, if you can. It's, okay. Uh, yes, the uh, it's the uh, the number one uh, uh, the longest running show in American music theater history on Broadway now. We've been uh, running for 18 years. Uh, uh, we've been selling out the tour uh, for the last few years. We've been wandering around the country, and uh, with good reason because it really is. This is the iconic Broadway musical, and this is one of the greatest productions of it, I think, anywhere in the country. I, I would have to agree with that. I haven't seen the actual Broadway production. But you but saw the I film, I love the film. The I movie's the film. wonderful. They did a wonderful job. But if you see it, I guarantee for those people who've seen the movie, if they come see the Broadway show, it is so, it is a day and night difference. It is really? so much better. It's so Well, it's alive. It's electric. We have, um, let me put it this way. I, uh, I'm, I'm lucky enough to be working with uh, 12 women in lingerie every night. So. <laughs> I hate my life. Okay, and you play Billy Flynn. Billy Flynn is the uh, very slick, uh, the silver-tongued lawyer who drives the show. Uh, it's uh, the show revolves around uh, uh, Roxy Hart, a chorus girl who apps who, uh, who uh, murders her uh, her uh, boyfriend on the side, and uh, she's uh, and, and Billy Flynn comes in as the slick lawyer and gets her off in front of the jury because he turns her into a celebrity, and they mm -hmm. hold celebrities to different standards. So the show that originated back in the 20s in Chicago is now having it, uh, it has kind of a current motif as well after the uh, O.J. Simpson and uh, and everything else after right. that. It has that kind of, that pop culture. And I think it's part of the re the success of the show as well. Right, now uh, this is a little kind of racy type of show. Like you said, you're you're working with 12 women in lingerie. Is this a family affair or is this? Uh, I would say any child over the age of uh, 13, especially okay. if they if they love the theater, if, you're, mm -hmm. if your child is, lo loves dancing, this is the show to take them to because this was Bob Fosse's legendary choreography, the best stuff that's ever been done on a stage. You can't mm -hmm. see this style of musical anywhere. Nobody has that, it seems to have that talent anymore that Bob Fosse was singular. And of course, the best music that can and have ever wrote. Now I have to ask, did the dancing skills come from Dancing with the Stars or did those proceed your time on Dancing uh, with the Stars? You know, I was the guy that would go to the wedding reception with a glass of Chardonnay and look at everybody on the dance floor and say, <laughs> knock yourself out, Shriners, <laughs> not me. Uh, I had to go on, when I went on Dancing with the Stars that first year that I was on it, uh, I had to start from, from uh, ground zero. Mm -hmm. So a lot of it, my confidence in moving on stage, my, my sense of myself as a dancer, it's all come from that. Yeah. That's incredible. Yeah. Okay, so tell us a little bit more about the show. Um, we could get tickets on Wagner Noel com by the way. Mm -hmm. um, tonight is mostly sold out, from what I hear. Uh, the uh, yeah, we, we're here for two <laughs> nights. Uh, the final night, of course, we have some tickets left. Okay. Uh, but uh, but if uh, run, run, don't walk. It's uh, as I say, it's a legendary experience to see this, the legendary show on Broadway. There's nothing like this. Very exciting. Well, we're glad to have you here Thank you. in studio and in Midland, Odessa. It's very exciting. Great to be here. Thank you.